All right, it's time for a devish, devilish little build for you today. I decided we're going to jump onto the rift today. And also, try and... Hold on, this is from the last game. Work! Work! Huh, there we go, got it working. To we're going to do something... A little bit spicy. In. I, uh... Some of my most viewed videos on my entire channel, ever, have been what uh, I personally have called the most annoying Teemo build ever. And the goal of those builds has never been much. This is all out of whack here. Hold on, let me just double check. Just Let me just change this. I have no idea who I'm against, by the way. It's either Ari or it's just Corgi or it's... Nico, it's... Do we have a jungler? I, 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 I don't have no idea. Uh... Annoying team builds. I love annoying team builds because I can't I can't lose. Okay, I can't lose. I, I you know after that last I, from yesterday's video I'm just kind of coming off the back of it And I think I'm coming down with something. I'm feeling a little bit bit meh I Had like migraines yesterday. I've had migraines today I played one game a league and I had fun playing Renekton and just being a just being a problem not even out here winning particularly just being a problem and I had the time of my life. And I'm thinking, man, I really can't lose on Teemo. Because here's the thing, right? You come top, you gank me, you kill me a lot. I know I'm under your skin, buddy, so I win. I actually win lane. Well, that just means I win lane. I'm, I, which means I win. I lose lane, I'm having fun. Which means I win. I can't. I literally can't lose. So, right, turns out we're against Corky, which, to be honest, was probably the last person on the list that I would have said. No, wait, hold on. No, it's Nico. Never mind. Yeah, it's Nico. It's 100% Nico. Of course it's Nico. Why would Corky be running exhaust topside? I mean, maybe he would. It just doesn't make any sense. So let's uh, let's let's not get it twisted here. Let's 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 remember. Count the minions. Don't be don't be silly. It's free. She's gonna she's trying gonna try and be a, a an E into me. And I'm gonna do my best to try and avoid getting caught by that E. He says being caught by the E, of course. I mean, to be fair, it was, like, slightly obvious because, literally, it, it also copies the... I mean, if, if I was if I was a moron, at the very least, it copies Corky's level. And it says Corky is level 1. Which, obviously, is not the case. Oh, grasp! Sorry, okay, what, what are we going, you're probably wondering. We're going to be going, like, Hullbreaker. Uh, you know, I, I realized I should probably build quite a lot of magic damage, uh, magic resistance, sorry, because like this entire team are like full blown all about that sauce. Hold on, I'm not saying I win this, but I do okay in that fight. You know what? We flash that, we flash that, we flash that. We're going to get flashed on big style here. If I can just get it under tower, that would be nice. You know, I've, I've got no idea how to lane against Nico. It's just so sad. So, Hullbreaker. I was thinking maybe, like, Frostfire Gauntlet. But now that I'm seeing that I'm against, like, a lot of magic damage on this team. I'm trying to figure out what that means for me, personally. Well, alrighty. <laughs> Let's, uh... <laughs> I was trying to figure out the cooldown, man. I really wish she flashed. I was trying to get flash out of her or something. That's so silly. Okay, hold on. Is there any... Wait, Frost... So, Frost... Iceborne Gauntlet, sorry. That doesn't give me any MR, which is super duper sad. So, give me that. Give me that. Send me back to lane. We're going to need something that's going to give us magic resistance. Because, like, I mean, realistically, looking at the teams here, you got Ari mid lane. You got Nico. You got, I mean, you got like the the magic damage off of Corky because he does like mostly magic damage. Like, was it eighty five percent of his uh, his AD or attack attack damage is converted into um, magic damage? I suppose. I think I think that's how it works. And then yeah, that's that's three members of the enemy team that are going to be pumping out like quite a lot of of that going on. Why if you trolling me? I don't think anybody's trolling you, man. Who who's saying that? Hecarim? Oh, it's Zeri that said that. Hey, listen, the team's, the team's... I mean, we've already got five kills. It's five minutes into the game. Don't don't worry. Don't worry about it. I need to get I need to get on my counting minions 
type B right now. I was really looking forward to doing my my sit my okay you're gonna just push the wave well i can't tell you i'm not a respecter i can't tell you i'm not a respecter if you're just pushing the wave straight into me i am um, i don't know this game's going pretty well i'm one of the three deaths and uh, yeah that's unfortunate but like at the same time hey listen it is what it is it's big news i i, I want I, i'm telling you though i've got no idea how to how to lane again how what i mean what are you supposed to do there i had the happy feet but your Q cooldown is very low. In fact, your whole situation is very low. Holy crap, I lived. I, 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 <laughs> I know. Holy crap, she has six. I, I did, I gotta be real, man. I hate the new, uh, the new pop. Well, like, I don't hate it. Like, it's obviously good, okay? But I'm just saying, like, playing against new Nico. <laughs> Like her OE, I, I my muscle memory is all out of whack. I, quite frankly, my muscle memory is all janked up because now her OE, like it used to just like you all, it was, bad, it was a bad OE. I'll give you that much, right? She, she would just go up and down, and then it would root you on the land. Now she like knocks you up a little bit earlier, so like the muscle memory needs a little bit of like work on it because you're like I know I I knew when to flash. Now I don't quite know when to flash. But yeah, I'm having. I mean, I'm not having a great start. But um, justice will prevail. Like, you can play your... I know I deserve it as well. <laughs> Don't get me wrong. Like, I'm sitting here like, I had this coming. Because I was like, I'm going to play Teemo today. So I get it. I had it coming. I'm not really that behind in CS. So, so like, who really minds? Not me, that's for sure. Um, but yeah, like, thank you so much for all the love on the videos. Dear Lord, does it, does it warm the old heart? I, uh, I, I, I'm, I'm really appreciative of it. And just, I'm loving the vibes. I hate to be like that guy who's like, I'm just here for the vibes, but dude. Here we are. Been thoroughly enjoying League of Legends. And like, I'm, I'm, because I like maybe took like a little bit of time away from the League of Legends community, I feel like I'm like maybe somewhat immune to the criticisms of, the, I feel like I broke free, you know? Does that make sense? Like, Nothing matters to me anymore, except in my own enjoyment. I'm, I've gone full selfish mode. I mean, go on, son. On you go. You're gonna cue my wave, aren't you? There you go. That's unfortunate. I don't really have... I mean, we've got flash over, which is fantastic. Let's not, um... Let's not get upset about it but yeah like the whole like i'm like oh i don't want to i can't be cringe in the league of legends community i can't care about things caring about things is so cringe now i'm just like i i, I simply i simply could not care it's all about just like having a good time at this point for me and oh i may be cringe but i am free i'm so free I'm a free lane, is what I am. I've been honest with you. I'm, I'm pretty free as far as that's concerned. That being said, I know that there's a timer on her, like, doing damage to me. Eventually, every, that house of cards that Nico has built will come tumbling down. The only thing I don't want to see is, first of all, four minions, because I can see, I can see that there. <laughs> she knew I knew. She knew I knew. Oh, you didn't expect me to count the fucking minions, did you, bro? Well, there you go. Um, the only thing I don't want to see is Jin with a lot of kills, quite frankly. It's fine. We can we can, we can dodge these. You're gonna run on a mushroom. I was trying to get you to run on a mushroom, but you did not. Kaboom. I mean, I got like TP up in 30 seconds. That's why I'm like standing here, like, you know, just chilling. I think I can beat out quite a lot of her, her abilities here. Rampage. I don't know what's going on there. I can't imagine it's anything nice, though, so we're going to move the vibes off the screen because they're bad, man. Ooh, careful. Unstoppable. Throw down mushroom. 
I've been playing a little bit of Teemo in, in ranked. I've been having a good time on him. Obviously, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm not really worrying too much about... Um, well, that actually hit me. Oh, no. Oh, I have no mana. Whatever. We got, we got TP. So I'm going to back up. Let me think about what I want to go here, though. Let's pick you up. I think, like, a... A wit uh, no, Hullbreaker is good though as well, like Hullbreaker. Oh, gimme, gimme. You know what? Screw it, gimme, gimme. I, wa I want Hullbreaker first and foremost. Man, you do get quite the movement speed boost, don't you? Like, I, I have a movement speed boost that I'm popping, and, and, you and you did too, but you were just faster, apparently. <laughs> Oh, she's not even leaving. Nice, though. Humongous. Grass proc. I don't mind all that much. I'm obviously not going to kill anybody here. But, that's not what my job is. This game feels like it's almost going to be too, like, quick. I'm starting. I'm starting to get the the feel of the the winning against Nico aspect here. I'm feeling less uh, less worried about this the situation. Oh, gotta be careful because she's still poisoned. She running TP. She is running TP. That's okay. Here's my thoughts. I'm thinking I'm I'm about to be ganked very soon if I'm not careful. I mean, you know what, man? I don't think I am. It seems like there's bigger problems on the on the team than ain't me, you know? I think I'm the least amount of problem you could ask for. This person needs to back, though. They just keep on staying. And you know what, man? I'm gonna- I'm gonna stay- I'm gonna keep you here. You're too- you're so desperate. Oh, I'm so low. Oh, no. Can keep asking for a gank, but my cat arena is gonna do numbers here, buddy. My cat arena is gonna do numbers. I don't have the fucking mana. I don't have the mana to bounce another mushroom to stop her from backing. How sad is that? <laughs> All right, well we're gonna leave. It's unfortunate, but it is the way it goes. So, yeah, it's a decent amount of armor and magic resistance. Oh, you know what, man? I'm not that scared. Okay, I got the fright of my life, but... <laughs> oh, I get, that hurt my head. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> that hurt. That actually hurt. Yeah, it's fine, though. We're self-sufficient kings out here. Wow, that hurt. I really wish I had more than like zero mana so I could put some shrooms down or something. It's okay, let's back. What about a goal? Maybe like Phage? That could work. I could give us some movement speed. We're gonna lose like a little bit here. Maybe? Yeah? A wave at least. Nico has disappeared though. So, oh no, she's not. She's back. This is the most annoying thing ever, man. You're like, I'm gonna play a split pusher, and then, and then you're the enemy top winner is like, you know what, man? I'm not. I'm not leaving this lane. You couldn't pay me to leave this lane. Come on then. Come on then. She has Q up again already. That's scary. What is the cooldown on her abilities? Because they seem insanely low for what they are. I just don't understand Nico even even a little bit, man, it would appear. Obviously, I don't have any kill pressure. That's just kind of the way it goes. 
up against another ranged top player who has pretty solid disengage via either a, uh, like a, I don't know, does Q slow? I don't think it does. At the very least, a root or a snare, and then also she has like her W, which gives her more movement speed than I get for my terrible ability of pressing W. Am I being a sneaky boy here? Am I a sneaky boy? I don't think I'm being a sneaky boy. Okay, that was very bad for me. She's running straight into a damn shroom. You toast. You toast, my friend. Yes. <laughs> I'm so I'm getting absolutely gapped in top lane. It's insane. I need to start banning Nico, man. She's annoying itself. I, I I never have any issues with like the counting minions aspect. That part's like kind of fun for me. Like I, I like the I like the whole ooh who's it gonna be like is it gonna be Nico but in lane I'm just I don't know I remember when Nico like top I don't know but I don't want to see meta how many kills has she got sixteen you're not you're not getting a panic kill because Nico is coming top lane I'm afraid I remember like it, it was like a it was like I think when Nico was like kind of not like just released but kind of close and there was like an attack speed top lane build that was just uh, it was not something you wanted to, to to lean into it was really miserable it was really really miserable and um this i don't know i think it's cool that nico like thing is here's the here's the issue i don't really like when i heard about the nico changes i was like that sounds so awesome but I haven't really like experienced any of the fun shenanigans that you would expect to see from that. I've never seen Gromp walk into my lane. I've never seen Blue Buff walk mid. I just see like a caster minion or a, a, a melee minion. That's it. That's that's as far as my my experience with it goes, I guess. And that's almost that's almost sad, you know. There's so much potential for people to make some shasty shenanigans. If you guys surrender. I get fake pick from my GF. Missy's looking for a phone. I feel like I gotta maybe do another game of this because I feel almost like I've, I've, it's. You know what? There's nothing. We can, we can do a longer video. There's nothing wrong with that, right? Nothing wrong with that. But I didn't. I mean, I've just, I've just kind of been existing in late. Granted, I've, it's been. A little back and forth, but not quite the Teemo experience you're looking for. Hullbreaker on Teemo, certainly an interesting one. But I mean, I think I should be pretty solid as far as uh, being able to tank some of those mages on the enemy team. That being said, if Jen pulls up, well, he is one in seven. And we counter, we counter AD carries anyway, so like, who cares? We're taking our little turret. Just chilling. We actually do like really solid damage to the tower, funnily enough. It's only 19 minutes, but like I am I'm going to town on that turret. That'll be base hullbreaker, I guess. So let's keep smacking. Let's keep smacking. I'm really surprised that they are not surrendering. I know you get like some you get sometimes you get games like that. But clearly the enemy team have absolutely no interest in doing so. But usually, it's when I'm doing well is when they're like, well, we ain't surrendering. But I'm doing well is when they are surrendering. Sorry, I should say. Woo! Excuse me. Jeez, oh. Is that like a flash or something? Well, there you go. I mean, Zeri was, I think, complaining at the beginning of the game and wasn't having a great time. All of a sudden, 9-1.
It's good stuff. Say bye. Bye. Okay, we're going to jump to the next game. I'm going to jump straight back into it. We're going to come back in a minute. Uh, sorry, what was my what was my damage of that game? Was it was it any decent? I got to know. Who do I want to give it to? That guy's called not Hecarim. And he's playing Hecarim. He's a liar. I don't know. Give it to the Carina. Probably, I don't know. I wasn't really checking chat all that much. So, it's hard for me to tell if they were being friendly or not. I mean, our damage was more than Nami and Hecarim. Not bad. Anyway, we're going to jump into the next one. I'll see you in a minute. All right, all right, all right, partner. We're back in it once more. Right. That was a bit of a long... Um, What's the word I'm looking for? Warden screen. I think we're into Twisted Fate top. Welcome to Rift. Yesterday I posted an AD Twisted Fate video. And these, they're going Lethal Tempo. They're going... They, they're, they are, you know, potentially the things that we think they might be. Like, uh, we got ghosts. I think, did I run ghosts in that game? I have no idea. I think this could be a pretty solid matchup for me. And also, I wonder if they saw the video. And if they did see the video, I wonder if they noticed that it's, <laughs> it's me. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe that's presumptuous of me. But still. Oh, my goodness. Sorry, I've got, like, hiccups. I think I'm falling apart. I've had migraines. I don't know. What, okay, I don't know. It's really, really weird because, like, I've been kind of sitting feeling sorry for myself today. And, like, yesterday I was like, Ugh. But then I start playing League and then my, I, I don't know, I don't know, maybe it's because my brain is transfixed on something else. I used to, like, whenever, so, like, whenever I used to, like, want to have to, or not want to, but have to stay up all night for whatever reason. And I'm like, I need to have something to take my mind off of things. League was always, like, there to be, because it, 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 it kind of, like, toes the line of, like, you don't really need to be paying attention to play because like the muscle memory is all there like everything's like kind of you know it works for me so like that 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 was a it was a great game for that and maybe like there's something in there maybe it's got healing properties or something Aye. so fun fact you may not have known um but no i can you can blind uh Twisted Fate's cards. So if I want to stop him from gold carding me, I can blind him. And uh, it's good news. Oh, he's trying to pull the gold. It's obviously not going to let that happen. I think I still took like one single bit of damage. You know, dude, I don't know. These top lanes are all crazy now, man. I played against, like, a Nico last game. I got Twisted Fate. This shit doesn't make any goddamn sense. He he hit me with the, with the blue card. Alright, ghost down. We love to see that. Who's their jungler? Jarvan. Oh, I actually took Ignite this game. I did not mean to do that. I mean, like, I'm not going to complain about, like, having a little bit of extra pressure, I suppose. So, kind of is what it is. Let me... Let me... There we go. Uh, I was still I feel like I was still sold there. I don't think I was but it felt like I was okay Hold on. I need to I need to ward because there's a very strong Possibility of Jarvan making a dramatic entrance on me here Dude I am I'm sitting here like trying to remember who Rock Lee's teacher was Because I'm like, oh he the guy that does the dynamic entry and I'm and, and it's 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 eluding me, and it's really sad. Okay, Jarvan's mid. I gotta, like, try and CS for once in my life, you know what I mean? I'm just kind of, like, pushing it in to be annoying. But there's definitely something to be learned about, uh... Maybe act actively trying to... Actively trying to get some CS once in a while. 
The game is going fine, though. I don't see any, any reason to think otherwise. Even if, like, he does get some CS, it takes a lot of gold for TF to, like, start throwing hands. Once again, both sums down. Love it. Obviously, there's going to come an issue somewhat down the lane when he decides to start, like, leaving the lane. But, here's the thing. I want him to leave the lane. I've got Demolish. I'm, I'm playing Teemo and I'm going to go Hullbreaker. Like, these are all things that, like, actively benefit me to take towers and keep pushing and get tankier and get do 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 You know what I mean? He's going 80 Twisted Fate, which means that, like, the Hullbreaker is still valuable. Which means that, like, me going for, like, uh, Iceborne is, like, still worthwhile. There's a lot, there's a lot of sauce to unpack here. I've, I've got to remember my Q doesn't do any damage. <laughs> That's one thing, though. That is one thing. Whoops. Let's, uh, let's back. So here's what I think is going to happen. If he hits six... He always, he, he comes in on me. We got away. We're good. Okay, so. Let's, uh. Let's get a phage. Let's get that. We can't really afford much else, which is a little bit sad. But I think that's a good start. I think that's a good start. I'm feeling this one. This game, like, looks a little bit more even than the last one. We don't just have, like, a mid laner who is inexplicably, like, 19 and 0 at the 10 minute mark. I don't, I, like, I, I, your guess is as good as mine as to what happened there. Must have been, like, a really good Katarina player. Uh, what they were doing uh, on a normal game, I don't know. Maybe it was just a good game. Who knows? And the enemy team, respect to them for not surrendering. Because, like, the amount of times that, like, Obviously, it doesn't happen all that much. But the amount of times I've even gotten, like, slightly ahead, and then all of a sudden, the game is just over because they surrender. And I'm like, ah, oh, well, I guess I don't get to have my 15 minutes of doing well this week. <laughs> Excellent. I guess I'll just uh, go next. And then the next game is me getting absolutely slammed, and I just have to live with it. <laughs> you know, I got to respect them for, uh, for trying their best. But I don't, I don't know why I'm Teemo pilled right now, man. Like, I'll, I'll be honest with you. Like, I've, I've I've played, like, maybe half a dozen Teemo games in the last, like, you know, three or four days. Which is a lot. If you know anything about me, like, I get asked, like, fairly regularly. I got asked, like, a day or two ago. Like, who do you mean? I think it was, like, one of my friends who was talking to their, their friend about League of Legends. And, um... They were like, oh, who does, who does your friend mean? Like, and I got, I got a, like, a Facebook message from, like, a friend being like, hey, when my friend plays League, they want to know, like, who you mean. And I was like, I got, I got nothing to tell you. Like, I, I genuinely don't. I, I just, I just don't have anything to tell you. There's something about, like, playing the same champion too much. It just doesn't, like, spark a whole lot of joy in me. You know, like I, I, I I'm totally. Uh, to be fair, I think like one of the best ways to climb in League of Legends is to just play one champion, get or get pretty good at that champion, and then you know like know all your matchups, and then the, you have a better chance. Even if you're in a bad matchup, being in a bad matchup with a champion, you know how to play and how to play that that matchup. It's probably like infinitely better than being like, I am going to go to what League of Legends counters .com or whatever website people use, and then. That will tell me who the the highest probability champion, and it's like those those probabilities are all messed up, bro. And plus, it doesn't tell you how many games that person plays. Like if somebody, you know, I don't know. Do you know what I mean? And even then, like you might not know why that counter is the matchup. You might just be playing it because you're like, well, it says so, so I'm going to do it. You know, happens too often. Sometimes I'll be like, I'm gonna check the counter websites, and then I see. I see the counter website says this champion is good and I know I'm like that person picked that because they think it's a goddamn counter and then they don't play the lane well you know they don't play and I'm like I don't, they're not doing what I don't know I, maybe I don't even know why it counters either I'm just like 
This website says that you counter me. I don't know how, but you, I don't know. Unlucky, I guess? What's the deal with 80 Twisted Fates, man? This is really cool. Like, it's really cool to see one in the wild. But I'm also like, what spurred this individual to do this, you know? What, what is going on up there? To be fair, there's a chance. Actually, I don't know if there is a chance. Hold on, one second. Okay, Twisted Fate is not sitting behind this tower. <laughs> That's one way of finding out. <laughs> that sure is one way of learning if there's a TF sitting behind tower. I think we got enough for we got enough for Hullbreaker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When's when's my demolish back up though? That's why I gotta know. Palping missing here because like he's he's gone so. There we go. There's my demolish proc, and then I can go boop and get your terror. I don't like this one bit, man. I can't go near that either. This ain't bueno. I mean, the terror is free. I'll take it. First terror of the game. I am on the way. Hey, you don't need it, buddy. You don't need it. I don't even have enough for Q, man. I don't even have enough for Q. Still, first tower is pretty good. We got a kill on to TF. I'm certain that Shake was probably not complaining. Well, they, I'm sure he can find a way, but still, you know. So. Um, okay, here's the thing, right? Sheen, give me Sheen. Ace, Born, Gauntlet. Work me towards that. And congratulations. I'm now a permanent resident of this lane. Level 9 Iceborne Gauntlet. Pro uh, not an Iceborne Gauntlet. Hullbreaker. Probably not the best thing. I could go for it. How much is it giving me? 5 armor magic resistance. Nearby large minions gain 15 armor. 2 armor strength increase. I don't know. I mean, 60 attack damage, 400 HP. Movement speed, all that stuff. It's just like kind of saucy. I mean, he's just running. He like he actually has no interest, bro. I'm actually like a more. I'm just chasing after man. I'm chasing after. I'm like a tel telemarketer in real life, dude. Let them come. You think I'm scared? How many kills did have you got? Three kills. I'm like marginally scared. I'm not that scared. I've been more scared. I have also been less scared. Okay, here's 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 my tip for succeeding in this world. Don't stand in fucking glacial storm for like the entire duration of it and then flash out. That was a bad idea. Cause I was like, this is fine. I think did she flash as well? I'm not even sure. I think she just probably walked past me. But standing Looking at the walls. It's not a good idea. It ain't happening. TF didn't do that much damage to me though. I should really not I should not even bother trying to blink her either, to be fair. I need more magic resistance, is what I need. <laughs> the the five that Hullbreaker's given me. It's quite doing it for me. I'm gonna be honest. You may be thinking, Ross. What's with the build? Dude, I just I just made it up. I just made it up, man. Honestly, this is one of these situations where it's like, source, dude, just trust me. And that's it. This is a strict source, dude, just trust me moment. Where did you go, Mr. Fate? Where did you go? Did you go back here? Ooh. I'm just going to keep pushing. I said at the beginning of this. You want to keep coming top? I think that's the first time I've been ganked in these two games. I... Uh... Okay, we're gonna chill. We're gonna chill on that one. Man. Oh, 
League of Legends players, dude. Woohoo! All right. Well, he tried. Got to give him credit for that one. <laughs> that was like, honest to God, possibly the easiest fight of my entire life. I don't even remember the fight. I'm like, I don't know what happened. I just like blinked and he was dead. Oh, that's a lot of terror damage. Look at that terror damage. Ooh, I'll scared ahead. Okay, maybe Hullbreaker is like the sauce, dude. <laughs> maybe it is the sauce. I had no idea. But I'm actually just straight up doing 80 damage. Obviously, my 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 I'm 80 with a little like poison kicker, you know. Get a little bit of that damage going. In fact, TF is like like just left to go mid. So excuse me for a moment. I'm gonna get my Iceborne Gauntlet. Or I'm gonna get the money for my Eastborn Gauntlet, I should say. And we're chilling. And we're chilling. Are they gonna. Are they gonna okay, it looks like Nautilus is. No, nobody. Like, oh, it's too late. I've, I, you know what? I've wasted my time. I was like, like has, has nobody noticed what's happened? Oh, dude, I could have gotten. I probably, probably could have gotten terror. Like, nobody was paying attention. <laughs> Whatever. I'm going back top, brother. Let's go. Let's get up there. I mean, for the top side of their map, we're sound. Okay, every fed thought with attack, TF does some AP damage. Who cares, right? I'll beat him. <laughs> like, this, this whole portion, I mean, even maybe that a little bit, probably not. But, like, this whole portion, I'm good. As far as, like, the... Do I think you back here? I do think you back here. I don't think you stick around. You're standing all the way on a damn mushroom, my friend. Okay, now we've got Iceborn. Uh, but yeah, I mean, like we can we can get some we can get wet sand or something, and then all of a sudden, like, and Nebia don't hurt so bad. Dude, if I was, oh, I was, I was throwing hands on the ass, man. Woo! Go on, boys. Oh my God! Look at the flashes. It's huge. I get the assist as well. It's huge. I love it. I love it lots. Um, I think, I think we could probably go for like a uh, Meritrez, actually. Like, lots of like roots or again, all e all. Auto attack, yes. O E Q, no. E probably tenacity is going to be affecting as well. We can take that. It's fine. Uh, yeah, nothing from Jarvan, but Twisted Fate stun. If he does hit it with me, like an Evia stun as well, like all that kind of stuff. Gen W for his root as well is perfect. We can, we can. There's, there's some, there's, uh, there's an argument to be made. Also, just having like a little bit of MR, balancing out the stats a little bit. It's, it's nothing to, nothing to sniff at here. Sorry, I had to mute my mic because I always say S something is nothing to sniff at, and then I and then I have to sniff. So I, I didn't want to do that joke again, but I actually had to sniff because I'm a little bit sick. So you know, I had to. <clears throat> One, two, two, Timo top lane. A bad score, many would think. Pistol, some would say. But here we sit. Here I stand. Absolutely freaking sending it. <laughs> sending it. Living my life. I'm 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 gonna I'm 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 gonna neutralize any vision I see. If you wanna come top, if you wanna come deal with me, you come top and you deal with me. Alright? But I know there's a dragon coming up in 
50 seconds. So maybe I accidentally happened to time me really putting the pressure on top side with, uh, with you trying to get Dragon. Who knows? Gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be a little bit easy breezy right now. Oh, there's a Rift Herald mid. Well, maybe you should deal with that, huh? Maybe you should deal with that. What do you think about that? Okay, gotta be careful with the poison tick off. Okay, I'm accidentally the greatest dodger ever seen in, in, in the history of League of Legends. Well, ain't that a shame. I was thinking like maybe they lost vision of me. Maybe they weren't sure if I kept running or not. They knew. They knew. I can't believe I accidentally dodged like quite a lot of uh, abilities there. <laughs> totally by accident. <laughs> That's awesome. We did get dragon though, which is exactly what I wanted. Makes me want to maybe potentially go bot lane and try and get that going. Although considering well, Miss Fortune said earlier in this game, part of me is like, I don't think she wants to play that game. You know, I think she's just going to go bot lane, just right click stuff, which obviously I can't say I'm not a fan of, but I don't really necessarily, I don't think she's doing that to be a team player, right? I'm being a team player. It may not look like it because I'm just sitting top lane and pressing right click and Q sometimes, but like this is a team player mindset okay this is what team players do kaboom i mean there's four ball it's four top sorry i'm okay with that i'm okay with that they're sending them all they're sending them all yes <laughs> they are not fans of timo that bot tower is looking real juicy right now. Real juicy. Mm -mm -mm. Let me see it fall. Let me see it fall. Come on. Ah, beautiful. Love to see it. I really wish I took TP. I, I changed my runes and I accidentally forgot to remove teleport. Yeah, I forgot to remove ignite. Sorry. That's my bad. But I, I do miss it right now because I, I I wanted to play the, the, the teleport game. All right. Let's get up to top lane. As fast as we can. 14% movement speed buff. Woo boy. What an ability. What an ability. I go bot. Use team no, team no taunt. We baroon. I use my team no taunt. To set up for Baroon. They will, they will literally never be able to resist this maneuver. <laughs> Bro, they just, they uh, honestly, they, they just. Wait, we're not doing it! Ah! I didn't even get to the goddamn lane, man. I got immediately twisted feet ulting onto my skull. I don't know, maybe we, I don't think, uh, you know, it's too risky, it's too risky, isn't it? We got vision, it just means that like, Jarvan's gonna pull up and it's just bad news, isn't it, at the end of the day. Man, Anivia is so annoying, bro. I don't think there's a more annoying champion. I thought I muted her, dude, what the hell? How does she get through my mute? That's not what I want. What the? Bro, Shaco is real strong right now. That was like a an absolutely diabolical situation for him, and he still made it happen. Okay, we got flash out. Nice. That was a good flash as well. Just keep running. Just keep running. What what I can maybe try and make happen here is just like as many people bought as we can. Here's the thing. Do you know what the funny thing is, right? I think I'd fear better in these fights if I was allowed to move. I keep I keep ending up like pushing up against like a Nevia and like a Nevia or like Nautilus and neither of those is like a pleasurable activity, you know? It's not a good time. Yes, 
it ends up just being me getting stunned. Okay, I mean, this this is it now. We go that you go that now for sure. I don't think Anivia is going to chase me that hard, is she? I don't think that's her style, baby. I mean, she, oh my god, they're all super dead. They're all super duper dead. I don't even need to participate in that. I don't need to participate. Because that's now, that's now super doable. I got Jin pushing up against me here. Explosion. Okay, maybe I get out of here. Jarvan's here as well, so I'd like to leave. I sort of could be doing Baron. I, I, I don't know. I, I maybe I'm. I think I'm tunnel vision done, and I think I should get my my head out of that that mind space. What I'm gonna do? I don't have a whole lot to back for, but I'm gonna back and I'm gonna run ball again. And just like let it ride. I'd like that. I'd like that. Send me bot. We do have three thousand HP as Timo. Obviously, that's not the highest you could be. Like if I was really looking to rocket, man, you'd be seeing me with like the God Gogli. You'd be seeing me with the Warmogs. You'd be seeing me with all these other items, maybe like a Randuins, maybe the Thor Mails, etc. Uh, but I'm pretty happy with where I'm standing because I've got two hundred eighty, baby. <laughs> two hundred eighty. Oh wow, 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 wow. And I think. We, you know, we got a cup, maybe like one one dragon out of me being a dum dum bot. So I'm gonna go ahead and say, I mean, we've been we've been ran down quite a few times, but that's what it's all about. One of the few situations where I'm playing a champion, and I'm like, good, come. Maybe that's how you get yourself out of the mindset. See if you had like a bad day of like getting camped or being ganked at the wrong time, or just things are not going your way in League of Legends, man. Start playing champions that like want to get ganked, or champ, or like playing, like, playing, messing with a playstyle that invites the the aggro, you know. Like have a game of Alawi. Like what's what's it gonna hurt you, you know? Right, so we get this tower for free, guys, and nobody's stopping it, and I do lots of damage to it. Now I'm gonna throw all these mushrooms down here and see what happens. Alright, I guess I'll take this tower as well. Because I can tank it, and it's okay. <laughs> Let's go, man! It's like Bruiser Teemo. Man, this is criminal. I actually might go to prison for this one. You don't get, like, that much use out of the... The, 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 the Iceborne, but, like... There's something funny about dropping it, because you can now slow with like your Q into all, which is funny. Right. Time to go. After we take this. We have got Wet Sand now though. We got Baron Recall as well, which is very, very nice. <laughs> Where do I go? All the towers have been taken. My job is kind of done here. I don't I don't know. I don't know. What have they got? Who am I scared of? Something armory. See, that's 10% of damage. You know, the, the range debuffs? Mm. Let me think here. Let's go for a week. What can we, what can we pick up on the tank side of things? I, you know what? Like, I Titanic, I'm not going to hate on. I don't think it's going to be that good, but I think it's going to be... I've never, I don't think I've ever seen a Teemo run in it. I've never seen a, t a tank Teemo with a, a, a Tiamat or with a, with a Titanic Hydra in my life. There's probably... Almost certainly a reason for that, but all I'm thinking is what well, would be a funny thing for the enemy team to see? Granted, I mean, I'm a big respecter of the, the ADTF as well. I'm a big respecter. <laughs> Trying out silly builds and normals is what it's all about. And 
I, I mean, it's it's decent. Like, it, it can be decent. I got my ass beat by it, like, not that long ago. That was why I was like, I'm gonna do it again. Because I refuse to let that be the last, my last act. <laughs> I was like, no. I want to have one more shot at this. I mean, you can't destroy all of them, so... Bro, I, I'm going absolutely crazy with it. I tagged so much damage. Ignites everything, man. Wow, that was insane. I'm just, uh, dude, when have you seen a team last that long? Oh, man. Okay, Abumu's insane. He's insane. GG. That's, that was a good game. Oh, I mean, my team was, my, I see my team. My team was fine. My uh, Shaco was crazy. Like, he was, he was mental, man. He was going absolutely sick with it. Wowee. I kind of want to see the damage. I don't think, I mean, it's, it's not going to be anywhere on the levels, right? It's not going to be on the levels of, of Shaco. The terror damage might be interesting to have a look at. You kept a cool head from what I could tell. Don't think you were flaming anybody. Probably going to get a report down on the, the misfortune. Because I don't think she was probably not saying anything particularly constructive. An A. Let me see here. 18k damage. So, not bad. <laughs> Almost double TF's damage, which is cool. Did more than their bot lane. Very close to Anivia. And Anivia was pumped. I think, honestly, like 6k of that damage came from her attacking me. Maybe even more, actually. Maybe even more. So, maybe we have a look at graphs. We have a look at total damage to turrets. And then there, and there it is. And and there it is. Enemy, t enemy turret at 400 damage from my lane counterpart. <laughs> You could ulti into the terror and do more damage than that. You could just be ulting into terrors on cooldown and it would do more than that. It's a shame. Regardless, thank you so much for watching this video. Please give it a like if you enjoyed it and subscribe to the channel if you're new here. We just like doing silly dumb builds, having a bit of fun in League of Legends, playing other games, having some good times. Also, thank you so much for keeping me company today and I hope that I got to keep you some company as well. Have a wonderful day. Take care. I'll see you later. Bye.